a youngster's temper tantrum brought sympathetic smiles to the faces of the Queen and Prince Philip at the unveiling of a new war memorial today. Two-year-old Alfie Lunn appeared to have had his fill of the pomp and ceremony while presenting the Queen with a bunch of flowers at the unveiling of the monument which honors troops who served in modern conflicts. The boy, in a dark suit, started bawling and lashed out with his arms and legs while being held by his mother 26-year-old Corporal Michelle Lunn. The Queen and Duke of Edinburgh smiled as she tried to calm her son after the child flailed his arms around and refused to hand over the gift. His father Sergeant Mark Lunn, 29, who was also present, was awarded the military cross for his actions during a firefight in Basra. Mrs. Lunt said later, they're so unpredictable children, we tried our best. He was fine up until a few minutes before the Queen arrived. Alfie was all smiles moments later when he met Prime Minister Theresa May. A service of dedication was held following the unveiling of a new memorial at Victoria Embankment Gardens by the Queen. The statue honours the service and duty of both the UK armed forces and civilians in the Gulf region. Iraq and Afghanistan, and those who supported them back home, from 1990 to 2015. The Prince of Wales and the Duchess of Cornwall, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and Prince Harry, the Duke of York, the Earl and Countess of Wessex, the Princess Royal, the Duke and Duchess of Gloucester, the Duke of Kent and Princess Alexandra attended the event. Politicians Defence Secretary Sir Michael Fallon Foreign Secretary Boris Johnson and International Development Secretary Priti Patel also watched the unveiling of the